<sighs> well, this sucks. I guess we're gonna be on the GoPro for a little bit. Today I was kind of an idiot and I was working on my 240. I put my camera on my truck, just the hood of my truck, because I was just working right there. And then I had to run home real quick, not thinking anything of it. I drove my truck, my camera on the freaking hood, and it flew off. And we literally spent all day just trying to um, look for it and stuff. I actually found exactly where it dropped. Thankfully, there's a camera pointing at it too. So tomorrow, hopefully I can kind of get to the bottom of that. I put a thing on my Instagram as well. So if one of you found it and you're watching this, no hard feelings. Like, let's be honest, anyone that finds a camera on the ground, odds are it's gonna take it. I've been in that situation actually when I was younger, probably like 11 or 12, I was at Thompsonville Skate Park in Enfield. Shout out to if you guys live around there. My dad took me there and I was just riding my skateboard. I found a little video camera and I was, I was like half nervous, half excited. I was like, oh my God, what, what do I do with this and stuff? And turns out half an hour later, the dude came. He was like, hey, you guys see a video camera? And I was like, yo, got it right here, man. And um, he ended up getting his camera back. Kind of hoping that the same thing happens to me. I'm willing to pay for it. I obviously messed up, I acknowledge that. It just sucks because we've been working on our asses off the past three days. We have literally like three videos in the making and we're kind of spending some time on them and stuff and without the footage that we have on that camera, it's just kind of all a bust. So today I'm just gonna give you an update of really everything that we've been doing. We'll start with the E34. A couple of you were kind of bummed that I bought the E34 and yes, I know I said like, I wanna start focusing on like the cars that I really want and I meant that truthfully. But what you guys need to understand is I bought this car for $500 and no matter what, like I can, I can be 25, 35, 40. I'm always going to like just like working on just little things like this. Like the way something makes you feel like when you buy a car not running and you spend some time on it and you get it running and you, you fix it up a little bit. It just feels really good and I felt like I had the opportunity to do that and I bought this for so cheap that if I can get this running, which I know I will, if I'm under $1,000 in this thing completely, things worth at least $3,000. So it was a no-brainer for me and I also enjoy doing these little flip projects and stuff. I'll always do that. But my thing was, I'm not gonna sell the hot boy and go spend $10,000 on another huge project. This is kind of a little fun thing that I wanted to do and Will's working on the E36, Matt just got his wagon and I don't know, we can kind of all work on junky cars together and it was just something fun that I wanted to do. But with that being said, we're getting pretty serious on the 240. I started taking it apart today. We got the whole front bumper off and stuff. We're actually sending that to paint today. Actually, I have, I have more things that I wanna show you that I forgot to set up before I did, made this clip. Give me one sec. All right, so this is where things get a little more exciting. So we have the front bumper here. You guys can see that it's pretty messed up. If you guys have been following the channel, you know that I'm doing Drift Week 6. That's over in Texas, and I'm very, very excited. Actually, there's a lot of events that you guys can come out to as well, so I'm gonna put these up right now, and if you're around the area, come. I mean, I'll be having open seats if you guys wanna come shred with me in the 240. It's gonna be awesome, so definitely come check it out. But we're getting the bumper painted. I just ordered a new lip. We got these side skirts that I actually got from Jimmy Sylvia, and I got those spats from Jimmy Sylvia as well. I was originally gonna get this car painted in Colorado. I was going out to slush and everything. For a few reasons, I decided to skip out on that. I didn't want to, but I felt it was in my best interest to do that. And I was actually, right after that, I was gonna shoot over to Trevor's house, Motion Auto, shout out to you, Trevor. And we were actually gonna paint this thing. We we're gonna make it super sick before Drift Week, and we we're gonna make it nice. But obviously that didn't happen. So instead of painting it a different color, I kind of thought of just keeping it black for now. I mean, it may forever be black if we can kind of get the whole thing looking good, but we're gonna respray that black. We're gonna do the side skirts black the spats obviously to color match it and then we got these new wed sports i got these from quentin i'm super stoked on these the fitment isn't the best i think these are 17 by what sevens 17 by seven or eight they're obviously going to need a spacer we're up yeah no 17 by eight what's the the offset is what's the killer part though where's that wait does this say five by 100 that does say five by 100 dude what? So this is funny. These say five by 100. So I just hit up Clinton and I remember the box saying five by 114.3, but it says 114.3 right there. So now I just have no clue. We haven't test fitted these yet. We're just going to throw it on the back of the 240. 
and um, see if it fits. This is a disaster. Oh my God. Let's jack this thing up. All right, moment of truth here. And are these Subaru wheels or are these Nissan wheels? It's looking like it's gonna fit. All right, so what the hell is that 5x100 doing back there? I don't know. Maybe is they, that crazy? Maybe they just have one cast and That's and wild. Well, I guess just put it on real quick and see what it, how sunk it is. Cause it's got like a 56 offset or something. We're gonna have to run like a 25 mil spacer with these. I got them just cause they were super cheap and they're literally just, just drift spares. And it was a cool, it was cool to me that it was a real wheel instead of just buying like some reps. So these were actually cheaper than reps. So pretty yeah. sick. It's sunk though. Oh, it's so sunk. <laughs> it's so sunk, dude. That looks like shit. <laughs> It's really bad. Anyways, we got some drift spares. They were really cheap. We'll run some spacers. It's all good. I'm not concerned with that. I was only concerned if it was a 5x100 because that would have been super weird. But all of this is going to the paint shop. And we also got this very special box, which Will, would you like to do the honors in holding this? I've been holding this box for quite some time because I didn't want to put it on because one, the things are unpainted in here. And two, I didn't want to put them on until I was like fully ready with everything that I wanted to do. And we're getting close to that. So check this out. I probably should have opened it to make sure everything was good inside because it did come from Japan. But I guess we're gonna find out together. Looks like they packaged it right. We got some Koki tails, which I'm stoked about. I haven't opened the other ones yet, but this is gonna change the look of the back. Oh yeah. Dude, it's actually kind of crazy how expensive these are getting. I think I paid $550 unshipped, Dang. which is kind of unreal. This yeah. is the money shot right here. Are you yep. ready for this one? You can already tell what that is. Oh yeah. This is I've had these before, but I've never actually oh, bought them. Did you buy them from Sam? No, I didn't buy them. <laughs> kind of looks like it though, doesn't it? Looks like they came right off as drift bars. I thought it was supposed to be red. No, nope, oh, that's, 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 that's pink. That's sparkly pink too. That is sparkly pink. I got these because they were a little cheaper than the other ones. I think I found these suckers for 800 bucks. And the other ones painted a different color as well. For the most part, it's in, it's in good shape going on the little street car, so. We're gonna be getting these painted to, as well. Oh yeah, this one's white. Yep. <laughs> Dang, dude. Super hyped. Imagine if they were the same side. Yeah, They're not, right. but first set of Ganadors. Looks like a thing from Halo, like a spaceship Bought from myself. Halo. Fuck, dude. I love the Koki tail so much. Woo! What do you think? Sick. I actually love it. You know, the plan for the whole 240 video was we were gonna show you guys this stuff, they were gonna go to paint and we were so far ahead that they were gonna come back, we we're gonna throw it on the car, but I'm an idiot and I lost my camera. But I'll pay you <laughs> if you have it. I have owned up to my mistakes, we'll pay. But um, enough talking about my stuff. Let's go look at Matt's stuff because that dude's been busting ass for the past few days and we don't have any footage to acknowledge it. So you guys didn't even know, what the hell are you doing, dude? What's going on? I heard, oh. I probably should have just left you in there. Yeah, well, no, I have the release. Um, you guys didn't even know, but this thing is fully back together. Once again, we had a full video about it, but uh, uh, ZF's in it. The four, no, the three, three six point, six. yeah, three four six diff is in it, welded, all ready to go. We haven't even moved it yet. We've yeah. started it, but we haven't moved it. Have you confirmed that all the gears work? Yeah. Oh God, that didn't sound confident. So wait, you actually don't know? Oh, okay, all right. It's not a sale. This might be a disaster. All right, dude, let her rip. Oh, God, that doesn't look like it's gonna start. It's the, uh, jump pack. Oh, come on. Jesus, <laughs> everything's got a dead battery. Third time is always the charm. Let's hit it, dude. Dang, this thing actually looks pretty good. Sounds like your starter is getting stuck or something. Good? Nope, not good at all. <laughs> Look at that face of defeat. I hate the starter. He spent probably three hours on the starter today. That's accurate, right? Yeah, three time. hours on the starter. Nothing? <laughs> Woo! It takes three seconds to hold it. Not too bad, dude. Hopefully that forever starts. Sounds all right. Grab it. It ain't looking good for reliability for Matt. He didn't really do anything to the engine. Oh, it's moving. It's moving. Moving. I'll be honest, dude. Based on how this is running, you might have reliability. 
<laughs> this thing is not. My sound's the same when you started off. Why are they both doing that? Mine no one touched that. engines. I only did that since the ECU, though. Um, so I don't know. Yeah, maybe it's just like a warm up thing. He's making me nervous. That, yeah, Dude. I just said. It's dying. No, no, that was you. No, you that get was in you. Get a throttle. Wait a minute. How did that just start? Who cares? Can I try? You're probably in third. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Can I try? Can I try? Tag me in. Tag me in. Probably also not used to welding. Listen. True. You're not used to the welded diff life. You got to rev her up, dude. Not that the clutch is super light. Let me try. I'm expecting a way harder clutch. Like my brother's E36. You know this is the worst thing you could do right now. What is? Him. Why? With me? Yeah. Why? Give a fuck. He's gonna prove you wrong. You'd be like, oh, you're a fucking pussy. Yeah, I know. Hop in. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, let's hop in. I don't like that the ABS. It sounds like it's dying, huh? Yeah. There's a lot of lights on the dash. It's dying. Yeah, it's a, it's a drip car. It's dead, dude. It really sounds like it's kind of dead. What, like the motor? Yeah, like it's. it just feels like it's gonna die on me. Yeah. I think the alternator is pretty this, shitty. This, no, I was dude, Matt, totally joking. Matt, can you, dude, you can uh, never Matt is the most gullible person yeah. ever. It's actually kind of crazy how gullible Here, he is. Seatbelts, seatbelts, boy. Shut up, Seatbelts. Hey, you're like the wagon life. Oh, this shifter is a little weird, though. Yeah. It's solid. For what it is, dude? It's so fucking loud. I need a muffler. Dude, it drives pretty good, too. Um, like, it's a little bouncy. Oh it's got blown <laughs> coil. <laughs> Look at that dude in the back. <laughs> dude, I'm into it. Dude, I fucking love it. All right, dump the clutch, tractor. No, I can't do the first. I can't do it first. That's not fair. I don't give I a shit. I shouldn't even have drove it first. I kind of feel like an asshole. I apologize. I don't give a shit. Rather you break it, I just, buy get, it. I just get excited about things. Find a parking lot. All right, Matt doesn't want to drive it yet, which is fine. I'll drive it. I'll happily drive it. I want The clutch I feels fine. Everything you were saying is a myth. Go. She's slow. It's not. Dude, it's an E46 wagon, bro. Yeah, it's really not that What bad. about this bump? Well, let's try this. <laughs> <laughs> Just caught air. Caught air. The rear end caught air. <laughs> My ass caught air. This looks sick. I love this I car. I like it, dude. Dude. I approve. Fuck yeah. I don't know if that means much, but I approve of this message. I love this car. Oh. Yeah, the shifter. The, the shifter is a little sloppy. Yeah, it needs a short shift. You need one of those fucking $30 chassis mount shifters. Yeah, I wish they made it for my car. They don't? $250 for my car. Well, you made prop. You made more profit. Tell them what you made. Yeah, uh, I think if the guy picks up the keys, like the the door locks, I'll have nine hundred bucks. Nine hundred. Yeah. And you bought this for three seventy five and another hundred and fifty for yeah. all the miscellaneous parts you bought. Yeah, the parts car for three seventy five plus one hundred twenty for the aluminum radiator, which I got installed some other shit. Got this car for seventeen fifty with some spare coilovers that this makes me wheels on. on the E thirty four. If you put it in perspective that you're in a fucking heavy wagon, well, it's got some torque, you know? Yeah, it's got a little <coughs> block, dude. Yeah, I don't know it's what's doing some here. weird idling thing. It's gonna be rough, dude. You think it's so? It's pretty bouncy. Did you try like that? I, 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 I like, it seemed I, like you let off. Yeah. I have stumbled because I felt the rear end pick up. The fuck it carry? burnt tires, smell the rubber. Yeah. Dude. Where but like, it lit them up. But dude, overall, car, not bad. You definitely need some really heavy duty springs. Like yeah. you need some like 20K springs in this thing. Yeah, it's got some fucking- It's gonna feel rough, but like you want it to be rough. You yeah. like it rough or you want it- I want it want to be- Gorilla love style. I want style. it to be the- Gorilla love style. I want it to be everything that the Saab is not, so- Oh God, that just popped out of gear. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> That yeah. just popped out of gear, dude. I didn't do that. Yeah, I want it to be everything the Saab is not, so I want it low, fucking scraping, drifting, bouncy. Don't give a fuck. Bro, says about the dude who well. doesn't drive over a two-inch fucking pothole. Yeah, because he thinks his Saab's that low. I don't know, dude. I think we just hit a jump and it survived it. So 
Yeah. I think you're good. Brakes aren't great. You gotta clean this windshield, buddy. Oh, I'm sorry. The car was not up to driving. <laughs> yeah. driving standard the first two seconds it was fucking put together. <laughs> I'll be honest though, you you did good. Go. Yeah. Thank a lot, you, Will. A lot of help from Will. For you did sure. great, man. And Devin did. And Devin. A lot of help from Devin. Hey, I helped too. Yeah, you did. I think we all helped. That was a good I can want to hit these bombs. Let me hit these bombs. God. Not oh, it terrible. Took, it took a yeah. For blown suspension? Yeah. I don't think it's bad. Let me hit this bomb. Not bad. Pretty solid, huh? Dang, dude. I'm stoked. Well, I mean, you didn't get to drive it, but what do you think? I love it, to be honest. I'm fucking stoked. I think it's gonna be sick. I'm not gonna lie, I love it too. I Don't actually do. Break the fuck. I think I love any car that I get in and drive, though. Yeah. And then you can get in, like, if you're ever bored at a stoplight, you just. Yeah, you know, fucking juggle the shift knob. You can, like, even make it a challenge where you try to flip it once and get it back on. Yeah, like the bottle flip thing? No, Let it do it by no, itself? It's like a fucking. Oh, it's, it's like kind of hard. Like the what, what is it? Conundle? Dude, I'm close. All right. Bring wow, back. dude. Horn still work. works. Hell yeah, brother. That's yeah. nice. Does your horn work? No. Deduction and points, dude. Yeah, no, deduction that's not points. deduction yes, and points. No, that's not. That's part of the reliability. Horn, dude. It's part of reliability. Yo, We're going to see which one's most I've legal. I've yet to own a foreign car where the horn works. The oh, Jetta doesn't guy, work. I feel bad. This guy left his like. We got his bro. family right there. Family his, picture. Yeah. Let's take a look. I don't want to do that. Him and that's, his girl. That's cute. Yeah. It's a good picture. Let me see. Hit me back. Five hundred bucks. I think they. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Guess what? Now they're broken up. Oh my god. I still talk to this dude. <laughs> Does he watch this? Yes, he watches. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, guys, but it, it it clearly didn't mean too much if he left it in the car. So Damn. sorry. Jesus. <laughs> I hope they don't watch these together. Yeah, dude. Well, sorry. Fucking it clearly well, didn't mean much well, if they're the, fucking if it's still in the car, dude. This is fire too. Uh, yeah, the fucking, Can we go look at my car now? No. Yeah, no, we can. We can do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. The shifter is weird. It's though, shit. Dude. It needs a shifter. Yeah, no, the shifter is not great. It needs a shifter. You're gonna lose just because of that. Basic maintenance. Well, no, dude. I'll just keep that bitch in the fucking. What is that third. smell? Does anyone else smell that? Yeah. What is that smell? Ew. 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 What'd you what do? happened? I didn't do anything. Did you fart? Is this no, no, fire? that is not a fart. That smells like fucking diff fluid. I don't know what that smell is. It's <sighs> rancid though. Oh, diff or trans. It smells like you know what it smells like. It smells like Grillo's fucking hairspray. Ew. Doesn't it? Yeah, but with like a bit of must. Tell me this so doesn't look, smell like it's Grillo's fucking hair. Nasty. I I love you, Grillo, but I hate the smell of that mother. When I walk into his car, dude, I'm like, is I can't stand playing? the smell. Oh, it's playing. It smells like plastic. <laughs> just this. It's just the one tweeted. Wow, that's bad. I'd rather have nothing. Yeah, I, yeah dude. Dang. I'd rather listen to my phone. Yeah, that's so bad. Dude, like, I want to hear this thing bump. I want to die. Man, that's first. upsetting. You can't tell what gear you're in in this I thing. know. Put them together. We'll see which one's cooler. I mean, Wheels is gonna go a long way with Wheels, so. Yeah. Let's let's check out Wheels' car. Oh, that oh, e that e-brake works great. Oh wow, dude. I'm... All right. Well, I guess we're not charging the battery after all. Well, Here you go. Starts. Make sure you lock it, dude. Yeah. I mean, it's actually rolling. rolling. It's actually rolling. Oh, <laughs> shit. Oh my! Yes! No, it's not. Yes, it is. And the e-brakes up. All right. So on to Willie. What you got done to this thing, dude? I don't know what's been put out yet or not. Um, we got the so M3, the M3 bumper, M3 that's bumper. it. Yeah. Okay. I rolled these fenders a little bit. Tried to fix that a little. It's a little, whatever, how you doing? Got some sick new kidneys. Yeah. All black, which is fire. That makes the car, for sure. Uh, We're still waiting in the corner lights. Took the seat out. <laughs> no seat gang. Yeah, ripped apart all the interior. Like the whole front cluster. Use some nice wipes. Does this work? No. Oh okay. god, no. <laughs> clean this up. Vacuum the whole car. As you can tell, it's nice and clean in here. You know, other than the headliner, you don't need to look at that. Got this taped up though, or yeah, glued you, up a you, little bit. You started. Yeah. Yes, so the counts. 
Um, we're working on it. Got a sick new short shifter. Yeah, oh, that's it. Yep, yeah, that's that in is gear. in gear. That's yeah, in gear. That is in so gear. So I picked this up from Devin for $30. This is a $50 Amazon chassis shifter. And I'm kind of upset that we don't have any of the footage because like we showed everything and kind of reviewed it. You want to hit the brake real quick? It's a two-man job. Oh, God. You want to push in the clutch, too? <laughs> like, it's pretty direct. It's notchy. It feels really good. The only thing I didn't like about it is like this is fourth gear. That's third gear, like first. It's not notchy in gear. Yeah, no, not at all. But it's very direct and like, it's the, short. It's, it's way shorter. Short. It's very short. Got it engraved. It says don't suck. What's the thing behind that? Uh, nobody told me not to suck before I crashed the skyline in New Zealand. And that was the whole thing. So now I have no excuses. Just don't suck. Just don't suck. Just don't suck and you'll yeah. do great. We got this steering wheel quick release shout out to the fan rust buckets of maine hell yeah shout out to you got this sick love rust buckets quick release we got this seat bracket it's mounted ready to go planted seat bracket yeah. nice 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 one yeah and we just we... need uh the bride and then some side brackets so he was he was gonna take my prisma but thought one of my fake brides would look better in it so he's gonna take the bride oh jesus christ Come on, the boy. <laughs> we're ending it on that one and thank you guys for watching um we had three videos but we're gonna keep grinding to keep this schedule going sucks but we're gonna be on the gopro for a little bit but it is what it is we'll keep going in some direction maybe forward sideways hopefully not backwards peace